गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू स्टार्ट नेक्स्ट चैप्टर चैप्टर नंबर थर्ड वॉट इज द चैप्टर नंबर थर्ड एडिशन एंड सब्रेक्शन सो प्लीज ऑल द स्टूडेंट्स ओपन योर बुक एंड सी द पेज नंबर वन हंड्रेड फाइव पेज नंबर वन हंड्रेड फाइव एट द बिगिनिंग ऑफ द चैप्टर दे आर इज गिवन फिल इन द ब्लैंक्स फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन फिल इन द ब्लैंक्स means we have to solve addition and subtraction and all the carry and borrow you should keep in your mind okay so let's start first question 568 plus 134 how to add number 8 plus 4 at 8 plus 4 12 carry 1 Six plus three, nine. Nine plus one, ten. Carry one. Five plus one, six. Six plus one, seven. So what is our answer? Our answer seven hundred two. Next question: two hundred thirty-six plus five zero eight. There are the two parts. One part is here, another one part here. I will solve the one part, another one part. For the homework, you have to solve this this part. Okay, so next two hundred thirty six plus five hundred eight eight plus six at plus six fourteen carry one all the carry and borrow keep in your mind eight plus six fourteen carry one three plus one four two plus five. Seven. So, what is our answer? Our answer seven hundred forty-four. Now, six hundred two plus seven hundred sixty-seven. How to add the number two plus seven? First, we add the one place numbers. Two plus seven nine. Zero plus six six. Six plus seven thirty. So what's the answer? I will answer one thousand three hundred sixty-nine. Now question number seven. Question number seven. Five hundred sixty-eight. Now subtraction. Five hundred sixty-eight minus one hundred thirty-four. Now how to subtract? First we take the ones place digit. Eight minus four, four. Six minus three, three. Five minus one, four. So what our answer? Our answer is four hundred thirty-four. Now question number nine. Two minus one, one. One minus one, zero. Seven minus one, six. So what's answer? Answer is six hundred one. Now question number eleven. Nine minus six. Nine minus six. Three. Then nine minus zero. Nine and nine minus six. Three. So what answer? Our answer three hundred ninety-three. So this time we have to add and subtract the numbers. Okay. So one part I solved. Another one part you have to solve. Okay. Is that clear? Okay. Now, properties of addition. Now, what is the meaning of property of addition? Property of addition means some rules and regulations we have to follow during the addition. Okay. So, first property: number can be added in any order. Number can be added in any order. Their sum will remain the same. Now, what is the meaning of this sentence? Suppose We have more than three numbers. Which three numbers? Two hundred thirty, three hundred twenty, and four hundred ten. Suppose we have three numbers and we have to add them. Okay, so we can arrange the three numbers in any order. Okay, we can arrange the three numbers in any order. Means any number we can write on the top. Any number we can write on the bottom, and any number we can write in the middle position. Okay, but their answer, their sum will remain the same. So suppose 
230 we are writing on the top then 320 and then 410 add them now another order of the number suppose 410 on the top another one 230 and 320 on the bottom position now we add the number means there is a no particular sequence of the number okay we can arrange the numbers in any order now we add the number 0 6 3 plus 3 6 3 plus 2 5 plus 4 9 now 0 3 plus 1 4 4 plus 2 6 4 plus 2 6 6 plus 3 9 now check the both answer both answers are equal it means their answer will remain the same we can arrange the numbers in any order but their answer will remain the same okay so now clear the first property now next property of the addition second one second property when one is added when one is added to a number when one is added to a number the sum is the successor of the number successor what is the meaning of successor successor of the number do you know meaning of the successor successor means after number successor means after number so when one is added to a number if when we uh, when we add the one in any number so we get the after number of the particular number means we get the successor of the number let's look with the example suppose suppose we have the number is 200 40 and when we add the 1 in this number so we get the after number of this what is the after number of 240 241 it means 241 is a successor of 240 okay are you getting 241 is a successor of 240 means when one is added to a number or any number the sum is a successor of the number okay so clear this property now third property of the addition third property when zero is added when zero is added to a number the sum the sum is the number itself okay when zero is added to a number the sum is the number itself now meaning of this sentence suppose a number is 530 and when we add the zero in this number so we get the itself number means 530 answer so meaning of this sentence when we add the zero in any number so we get the itself number jab bhi hum zero ko kisi number mein plus karte hain add karte hain to humko wahi number answer mein milta hai 530 plus zero is equal to itself number so have you cleared the all three properties of the addition okay i repeat the all properties from first number can be added in any order their sum will remain the same means we can add the numbers in any order but their answer their sum will remain the same second property when one is added to a number the sum is the successor of a number means it means when one is added to any number we get the after number after number means successor of the 
number. Then third property, when zero is added to a number, the sum is the number itself. It means when we add the zero in any number, we get the itself number. So have you clear? Okay. Okay. So now all these students, turn your page, page number 108, 108, mental maths. Okay. Fill in the blanks. First question, two numbers are there in one side and another side only given the one number. So how to identify, how to find the another number here? So see carefully this number then this number, okay? There is a between there plus sign is equal to this number is present here but which number is not present, which number is absent there, see the both sides carefully, the two numbers are there in this side, another side only one number is there, one number is missing there, which number is missing, see carefully, this number is already present here, yes this number is absent in another side, okay, so we have to fill with this number, so what is the number? 27943 okay so now our both sides are equal it means uh, there is a plus sign but we have to equal the both sides we have to balance the both side now second question the successor of this number successor as I told you that what is the meaning of successor successor means after number okay means what is the after number of this when we add the one in any number so we get the successor suppose we add the plus one so nine plus one ten carry one 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 nine plus one ten okay sorry Okay, so this time we have to find out the successor. Successor means after number. Suppose you have any confusion, any doubt to get or find the successor of the number. So you can solve it side in the rough work. Okay, so first we write the number. How many times? Nine? Five times. We add the one. Successor means when we add the one in any number, so we get the successor. 9 plus 1, 10, carry 1, 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 9 plus 1, 10. So like that we can find the successor of the number. Now next question, this number plus this number just like first question, okay in one side two numbers are there. Now in other side only one number is there, which number is missing, see carefully, two numbers are here, but other side only one number just like this, okay, this number also present here, but one number is absent there, which number, this number, so we write this number here, 31952 and we, uh, we are balance the both side. Now question number 4, when we add the 0 in any number, when we add the 0 in this number, so we get the itself number, this is the property, so same number as the answer 37,005 plus 0, when we add the 0 in a number, so we get the itself number. So have you clear? Now continue question number 5. Question number 5, 41052 plus 0 is equal to, not 0, 1, 1 is there in your book, 41052 plus 1 is equal to, now what is the answer there, this is also property, I explained to you that when 1 is added to a number, so we get 
successor yes four if we have any confusion or any we facing the any difficulty to direct add the number so we can solve it side Okay, two plus one, three, five, zero, one, four. So now, what is the answer? Four one zero five three. Okay, so that's our answer. Now, question number six. Two one three four five plus dash is equal to three one three. Four, five. Okay. Which number we add in this? So we get this number. Now think about this question. Which number we add here with this number? So we get this answer. Carefully see the number. One stands hundred thousand. One stands hundred thousand. Up to here. All the digits are same. Okay. Only last digit is changed, and how many? Means when we add plus one, so we get the next number. It means one and other of place of the other digit zero. Means one then zero 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 zero. How many times? Four times zero. Okay, four times zero. When we add this number and this. So we get this answer. Okay, once again, see carefully. This number is here, and which number we add here? So we get this answer. One stands hundred thousand. One stands hundred thousand. Up to thousand, all digits are same, and both side. Then last digit changed. Okay, this number is bigger than this. Means when we add one in this number, so we get three. It means when we add two plus one and other the place of other digit, we put the zero. Means one, then zero 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 four times zero 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 four times here zero. So we get this answer. Okay, it is the mental maths. Huh? So you should all the question try to solve it mentally. Okay. Now question number seven. Three two five seven two plus two five nine one six is equal to dash plus three two five seven two. Once again, just like the previous question. See the this side. Two numbers are there in this side, and another side. One number is missing. This number here present, here also present, and this number other side missed. It means this number we have to fill here. Okay, and now both sides are balanced. Question number eight. One double zero, one double zero double zero plus four seven one nine eight is equal to dash. Let's check the number of digit in the both numbers. One two three four five. One two three four five. In both numbers, there are same number of digits. Five digits are there. Five digits are here. Okay. Now. Add the both number. It means eight, nine, one, seven, four plus one, five. That's our answer. Okay. So it's a mental mental maths means you should try to solve it in quickly. Okay.